don't think we have broken money either. <clears throat> the thought on certainly is uh, good old uh, Ray here. The only thing that was really missing on there was a S meter on the thought on and it would have really made it complete, but uh, that didn't worry people. Uh, as long as they could hear somebody, they were happy. And they out received just about everything else on the market in their days. Yeah, with this little GME 472, I, I paid the Blake uh, $50. It was quite strange. I said to him, uh, yeah, well, I said, I'll ask the obvious question. Everybody probably asked you, does it work? He said, yeah, it works. And I said, well, how do I know that, really? And uh, and then, you know, like I was going to give him $20 for it or something like that. But uh, he said, I can give you a demo. He said, I've got, you know, um, the Ute here. He said, and he said, I've got a, a later model in there. And, he said, I'll just pull the power lead out and put in this and put the aerial in. And he said, and you can give her a test on a repeater or something. And I said, oh, right, that sounds good enough to me. <clears throat> so uh, that's what I did. Uh, and uh, it all worked. Uh, yeah, the squash and all that was there and uh, yeah, the noise. and uh, Yeah, just sort of. And I got a repeater. Back. But there was a few old mantle radios there too, uh, and they absolutely wanted a fortune for them. I think they've got a bit wiser than some of these people, but they outwise themselves because when I was wandering around, they, they still had them. <laughs> and later on in the day, they were uh, out. Tom, on the top 40, uh, back some. Misty, 6.09, good morning, Al Four Guys. Tuesday, Monday, the 7th. And it was there, and I said to the bloke, I said, what do you want for that? And he said, uh, well, he said, my starting price is $550. And I said, well, I said, <laughs> I'll see you later. He said, well, that's only the starting price. I said, yeah, no, no. And I said, oh. And I said, oh, well, no way I'd pay any more than about 40 or 50 for it. <laughs> he nearly swallowed his tongue. <laughs> Had no way of testing it or anything. Uh, there's no 240 volts out there or anything. So, yeah, it was quite strange. And they, uh, I'm a bit lousy when it comes to those old mantle radios. I look at them and I say, oh, I really, do I need it or do I want it or anything? <clears throat> and... An old mantle radio. Actually, he wasn't carrying it. His name's Appleson, but I've got his card uh, here. And, and he's from Bathurst. Apple somebody. And it belongs to uh, an old, uh, uh, you know, historical radio uh, uh, club that got in Bathurst. They had a meeting once a month and all that sort of thing. And he gave me. But I said to this fellow carrying it, I said, how much you pay for that, mate? Just like that, he was wandering around. He said, oh, he said, it's not mine. He said, it's my father-in-law's. And he said, I'm just the carrier. And uh, so he introduced me to this bloke and I paid 50 or 60 dollars for it or something. It was a nice, nice old bake like radio. I, I never saw that one particularly myself. But he, um, um, yeah, he said, what do you, uh, you know, do you, you know, like them or collect them or what? And I said, oh, I collect them. And he said, uh, Oh, he said, gee, well, you can't come to one of our meetings. He said, you might like to join our club. Anyway, he gave me a card and all that, but I really felt that, um, like I'm getting around there same old days, but um, this old fellow, um, he looked like he'd be, you know, half a geriatric, really. <laughs> Terrible thing to say for a person I don't really know, but the way he carried on, and I thought he thought, gee, it'd be like an old hens meeting, one of these... Uh, one of these clubs there, I've got his card and you can never tell if I happen to be, you know, in town sometimes overnight at Bathurst, which I do uh, go there every now and again playing snooker and their meetings on one of those, uh, Look after yourself, have a good day, and uh, all going well, I'll hear you tomorrow, both of you, uh, and back to you there, Tony. Cheers, VK2TB going also. Yeah, fine there, Tom, VK2TB, and the group.